Download from the BBC of Dr Carl's Science Phone-In, which is broadcast as part of the Up All Night programme on 5 Live from 3am to 4am on Thursday mornings. Here's the latest edition. I'm delighted to greet Dr Carl, who joins us from the studios of the ABC in Sydney. Hello, Dr Carl. Hello, Dr Rod, and the weather here has been absolutely spiffing. Right, Billy and Abingdon wants to know if radar would work the same way in space as it does on the Earth. Absolutely, yes. And this is, in fact, one of the proofs that we did, in fact, go to the moon. And, Rod, I invite you, and I will save for you a seat in the front row of my lecture at the University of Sydney on the 20th of July this year of the four, on the 40th anniversary of the moon landing. Now, I can understand you might not be able to duck over and then duck back in time for your regular gig, man. <laughs> yeah. But Right? So, at the University of Sydney, I have met a man whose job 40 years ago was to design and build and use a Doppler radar that triggered in, that locked in on the Apollo spacecraft. Now, the Apollo spacecraft, each of them, there were about half a dozen, were launched from the Earth with a big rocket, rush, 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 and then the rocket switched off. And so gradually they slowed down. As they got further and further away from the Earth, the Earth was still pulling on them, slowing, slowing down. And then they got to a point where the gravity of the moon became stronger and they started to speed up again. And all the time, he was measuring their speed via the Doppler shift on radar, which works in outer space. And the radar dishes had to be aimed to a very tiny point in space. Even with today's technology, we could we, we could fake a, a helicopter uh, to broadcast back a fake echo, varying exactly as the Apollo spacecraft echo would have varied. But we could not, even with today's technology, get the helicopter to hover in exactly the same spot accurate to half a metre. Because uh-huh. the winds would bl- blow it around. And so, yes, Billy, to answer your question, radar does work in space, and that's one of the many proofs that we did make it to the moon and back.